Eseri Namuswe, a resident of Kevin and Zambia, has been crossing the Katwe pedestrian bridge with her two sons frequently for a number of years. Though she's happy about the demolition of the pedestrian bridge to pave way for a new steel deck, she feels KCCA must rebuild it very quickly. Uh, one time I was crossing this road and there was an accident. It involved a parent and a kid. kid uh, they wanted to cross but of course I think the kid feared and at the end of it all she had to run back and the, one car was coming and another one was coming. So the parent wanted to rescue the kid and eventually one of the speeding car hit them. Other road users who witnessed the demolition believe Queensway had become a death trap for those attempting to cross. We were told there was a ghost that kills people every month on this road, but I think the accidents are caused by the narrow road. This bridge has been in bad shape and it has caused many accidents among students and up here and on the lower side we have schools. The Katwe pedestrian footbridge over here has lasted for over 15 years, a period long enough for it to depreciate. Now its demolition is a measure by KCCA to introduce pedestrian safety. KCCA Executive Director Jennifer Msisi says KCCA is working with a private partner to have a new bridge constructed. The construction of the new bridge is likely to take more than two months. We have accidents, so we are just appealing on the, to the public as well as the community using this bridge to be careful as they cross over so that we don't have accidents. But we are going to restore the bridge uh, as soon as possible. We are mobilizing the funding and we are also uh, working with a private partner to see that it's achieved as, as soon as possible. According to KCCA, many road users have failed to respect zebra crossings and the bridges are part of the measures to prevent accidents. Other areas in which KCCA expects to construct pedestrian bridges include around the Uganda Management Institute along Jinja Road, Makerele Hill Road and around Game Lugogo at the Chadondo Rugby Grounds. Andrew Anitwe, NTV, Kampala.